Here's how I rename files using presets in the batch rename feature of Bridge. It's fast, and since you only have to type a name once, it avoids typos. The first thing I have to do is replace the nonsense string that each camera puts in front of the file name with my initials. The way I do that is I use a preset that I saved that does it for each camera. I highlight all of the files, right click, batch rename, and I choose my Mark IV string substitution preset that will put PAE in front of the file name in place of the underscore Y2H the camera uses. Click rename and now all of my files have PAE in front of them. Next, I make sure I'm sorted by date created and then I go through each file and rename it. First I select all the images that will have the same name, the black crested tip mouse in this example. I right click I choose the batch rename feature. I look for that bird in my list and I have right here the black crested titmouse. I select it and I click rename. Now all those files have black crested titmouse in the name. Move on to the next one. Right click, batch rename, find chipping sparrow, since that happens to be a chipping sparrow. Click rename and that's done. Go on to the next set. This is the Texas Spiny Lizard. Right click, batch rename, look for Texas Spiny Lizard. Ah, I don't have one yet, so I'll need to make one. Just highlight this, type very carefully, Texas Spiny Lizard. Don't hit rename yet. Copy this and click save. Paste it in the box. Now I'll have a preset for the Texas Spiny Lizard. Now I can click rename. And you just continue on in this manner until you have all your files named. When I process different types of images, I clear the presets and I start over. That's pretty much it.